Yeah, sorry. Yeah, oh yeah. That's <laughs> All right, so we are live on YouTube. Give me two seconds. All right, so we have the newest update. I'm with Bucci. Hi, guys. So I'll have link to his information in the description below after I get to uh, edit the video description. So we have the newest update, which is 2019.40.50.1. This is a hardware three car. However, we are in Canada, so something to keep in note. <laughs> you you see the pylons though, right? Yes, I do see the pylons like every day. Even like um, this morning, I took it out for a spin. I saw a pylon, but I didn't see the stop sign visualization. Okay, Which so sucks. adjacent speed lane uh, lane speeds. I was reading this on the way to your house. Uh, they merge at different lanes, uh, different speeds now. I am not in Canada. Oh, settle down, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> So they they the car will change lanes now uh, better. So it's saying if it's like the cars are moving faster in a neighboring lane, it'll speed up or it'll slow down. So it's more intuitive. It's smarter. So we have voice commands. This was one of the big ones. He tweeted about this a long time ago. Well, text message support, right? Yeah, text message support. You can change the climate. So, so you set the climate to 70. So... Turn on the passenger seated uh, heated seats, and it actually like it popped up there, and it just turned on there. That's actually kind of incredible. Wow, that's really cool. Uh, send a text message. Show the rear camera. So, show the rear camera. Neat. That's cool because you can do it all hands free, right? Yeah, like while you're exactly. driving, you just click just the, the button, button in there and then speak. Close the rear camera. Okay. <laughs> it's like that's awesome. I didn't even know that you could do that. Yeah. Cool. So voice commands. That's like kind of amazing, right? True. Yeah. That that's really cool. Oh, oh, you can even open the glove box. All right. Open the glove box. Whoa. Good thing I don't have anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All, All right, right, so... I, I guess you can close it. You know how they have the auto frunk and auto trunk? Like, I have the auto frunk yeah. on mine. You're going to see people hmm. create the auto closer of the glove box. Just wait for it. I gave someone a business idea right now. True. Yeah. Lots of tickets. Hmm. They're saying congrats on the baby. Oh, thank you, backseat baller. Okay. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, phone improvements. Have you tried this at all? Uh, no, not yet. So when you receive a message, you can press the right scroll button to have your text messages read out loud, and then press again to respond by speaking out loud. So I think... Application um, launcher. Bluetooth. Do, do I need to give it some form of authorization to do that? I imagine so. You got to allow it to sync messages under Bluetooth. Is there anything under here? Because this is application launcher, but the thing is, is every phone is different. Can't be under driving. Well, maybe, because, I mean, you're driving and then texting. Autopilot, if you want to text while you're on autopilot. No, it doesn't make sense. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, hold on one second. I'm going to go off his phone just in case there's anything private. Uh... Thanks, Mark. No, that's dialer. So it shows dialer, contacts, recents, and then favorites. So there's no real settings for it on, on this screen. Hold on one second. Yeah, that, that's strange. There's nothing. No top right. No, there's nothing in the top right. It's just all, like, you can delete stuff, but there's no... There's no settings. Maybe Bluetooth? Is it from my phone? Oh, here you go. Bluetooth. If you go to Bluetooth, it's oh, a sync, sync messages. messages. Yeah, I go to Bluetooth on the phone. And then you can sync messages. Oh, chime on new, new message. message yeah. So you can actually enable it. So it'll chime you every time you get a new text message. Gotcha. So that's kind of cool. Uh, I would text so you, but sync, I'm... sync would be to read out the message. To read it out, yeah. Well, it's going to sync your messages somehow. And then it's going to chime whenever it gets a new one. Good. Uh, Do you have anyone that can text you? Uh, Do you know anyone that's up? I would text um, you, but I'm recording with this. 
All right, let me test uh, text Habib, Tesla Habib. Yeah. Now tax them to test it. Mark, can you tax them? <laughs> <laughs> tax me your, send me your number, Mark said. All right, I'm sending it right now, Mark. All right, Mark's going to receive the number. We're going to try it out. You don't mind, right? No, that's No? Fine. Okay. If Mark gives you a hard time, mine is downloading. Awesome. This is so cool. Oh, the other thing I want to point out before I forget, the Bucci actually noticed this. The icon up here has changed. So it used to be that big red warning check engine yep. light symbol. <laughs> now it's just like a nice small wide, not so not so like in your yeah, face. Exactly. Oh my god, your car is ready to like blow up. Uh, what I think is interesting about this, maybe they're using this one for like less important notifications. Maybe. And then more important notifications, it goes back to the red one. Yeah, maybe like tire pressures and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. Right? So when shield washer fluid, it makes sense for it to be like this, right? Okay. So, Mark, you have his number, number now. Yeah. And if you tax them, it should pop up. One sec. These iPhone users <laughs> take so long. All right, let's 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 go back to uh, release notes. Let's let's continue as we wait for Mark. Uh, camping mode. So this maintains t air temperature, lighting, uh, everything else. And that's pretty simple if you go to here. Uh, oh, so the message came in. And then, oh, it's... The message came in on my phone, but... But not on not here. On the, not on the car. And it didn't chime. No, it didn't even chime or anything. Hmm. Interesting. Uh... Sorry, I was saying, so you notice this? This is new too. Remember the climate used to be oh, like yeah. little buttons up here? Now it's like on, dog, or camp. And it actually tells you when the battery hits, blah, blah, blah. So that's kind of cool. And it's it's nicer. It's easier to understand where everything is. Uh, let's go back to release notes. There's a couple other things we're going to get to, but uh, let's see. Tesla Theater, you have to, you can watch Twitch and Tesla Theater now, which is yeah. what you're saying, which is cool. And we'll talk about that in a sec. Stardew Valley, we'll come back to all the games. It's actually a really popular game, eh? Oh, yeah. I didn't yeah. <laughs> back am in. Voice keyboard, you can now use dictation to input your text into your car. Speech. That is cool. Speech to text? Yeah, speech to text. So if you're like on a, we'll try it on the web browser. Then we have tracks, which we played around with a little bit. We couldn't get it to work. Oh, maybe you need to be in drive for it to enable. All right. So he's in drive now, so if you can send him a text. Is your volume muted? Oh, yes, we did. Yeah. So the volume's on now. And he's in drive. Uh, save dash cam clips on honk. That's kind of cool, too. Did you enable that? Um, no. Do you plan to or no? When you honk at someone, it will save your dash cam clip. I don't know the... Uh, I don't know. I rarely honk, never ever. <laughs> yeah. And then additional navigation settings are now saved to your driver profile, such as volume levels for navigation, voice guidance, and stuff, which is nice. I like that they're doing this. Don't like that honk thing. I do it a lot. So that's that's pretty much the update. There's a couple of things we did notice, though. So if you go to the top, which he was pointing out... Uh, <laughs> Okay. Bucci is pointing out that there's no more arcade up here. You can't get to the arcade anymore from the top. Uh, you have to... Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> you have to go to the bottom and then entertain. Entertainment? Yeah. So, we have Backgammon, Stardew Valley. Is there anything else that they, like, hit in there? Let's, let's start from the bottom. T tell me if you notice anything. Uh, super Breakout... Uh, yeah, Super Breakout is new as well, right? Yeah, I don't remember Super Breakout being there. I, this this oh, screen's yeah. new. I'm so d addicted to 2048. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and then Stardew Valley, Valley, the value, the blah, blah. and then we have Twitch on this side, which is new, which is kind of cool. I should be streaming this on Twitch, and then we can watch ourselves. Like Inception. <laughs> like a screen within a screen. Cool. Theater is 
currently unavailable check your internet connection what? great demonstration <laughs> man i'm still kind of hooked up to the wi-fi yeah oh you are still on wi-fi and it's not working that's strange uh and then what else was there oh this okay so this thing we couldn't figure it out so it has tracks and we only did this like temporarily we're trying to figure it out and what it did and everything Takes a long time to load, eh? So, do you want to do a demonstration of however you got to it before? So it has like so, record, play, pause. I don't know what this is. The volume of what, whatever. Yeah, and it has load and save, which I don't know what I'm loading <laughs> and saving. So <laughs> I can click uh, this button, and this icon comes out. So it's like a drum beat. And should I? Be So that's pretty much it. I don't, I don't know what, what to do. Oops. Add a beat sound. So it's like this your own personal recording studio or something? Yeah. But like, we're trying to figure it out. So if you hit record, it's recording now. <laughs> this is when we lose all the viewers. <laughs> yeah. And then you can hit save. And then, like, load. I don't know what you're load. Like, if so you, you click load, load, it just like. Oh, is it loading? I, I don't know. And then I noticed. Well, now it's more responsive. I don't know. It's really strange, right? Yeah. And this should be like a repeat. Yeah. Second. So, I don't know. This part of the update, I'm not too sure. I'd have to play around with this yeah. a lot more. Uh, I'll, I'll we'll come, come back. Yeah, yeah. This is not here nor there. But. If there's anything specific you guys want to see, I mean, we can go for a drive, but you you will see the pylons, but you won't see anything else. No visualizations. Okay, do you know where there's pylons nearby? Um, there's always construction, so... Okay, let's go for a quick drive. I'll show you guys the pylons. Like, this is a hardware 3. This one here, that's old, outdated hardware, this car. <laughs> <laughs> that's Mother Frunker. The Lord is... But, uh, yeah, thanks. <laughs> But yeah, his his car has pylons. It just because we're in Canada, it doesn't see. Uh, Changes. Yeah. So we have street lights there, but there's no street lights here. And I don't know. Maybe I need to activate. Well, it's. I saw the release notes online for other people, and it said it's like additional display stuff, but you have no. There, there's nothing additional like exactly it's there's still the same standard oh there same. there's the pylon right there that we just passed that was a hydrant fire hydrant was it yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we're coming up to a stop sign and yeah stop you know, sign no visual light, so. no and it wasn't on the release notes no because we are in canada fair enough yes yeah so i think i don't know if it's a u.s only thing I wonder if it's gonna pop up. So there's a fire hydrant coming up right here. And let's see if we can see both. It pops up as a pylon. Yeah, it pops it up as a pylon. That's interesting. Yeah, it's it's just not available. Like there's no settings for it. Uh, I think it's because of our location. And it doesn't see the traffic lights? No traffic lights, no nothing. It's, and this is a hardware three car, like 100%. So, uh, it definitely has to be a uh, Canadian release thing. Like, I I know a lot of our release things, we get it uh, okay. later. Yeah. Is your phone muted? Yes, my phone is muted. Can you unmute your phone? Maybe that's why you're not receiving the text messages? Okay, so... Oh, okay, now. So, Backseat Baller, can you text again now? Yeah, send us a text again. I'm really curious to see how well that works. Yeah, my phone is always on vibration, so. He said no. C come on, let's go, get the text going. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He already spent 50 cents. Okay, I'll reimburse you 50 cents. Oh, Roman. Because he's, he's in the US. <laughs> yeah, Roman. Yeah. 
fifty cents. Yes, yeah, twenty five for a baller. <laughs> for a baller, I know, yeah, eh? Nothing. For a baller who's complaining about fifty cents here, <laughs> he just did it again. There's another fifty cents wasted. I don't see no message up here. Yeah. <laughs> so let me engage the pilot and see. Yeah. So I mean. There's no visualization in Canada. Uh, the fire hydrant again popped yeah, up as a cone. Yeah, as a cone. Yeah. I don't think it's an Android thing. There's another one there. There's another one on the screen. That's kind of freaky. I mean, the shorts have been really quiet lately. Now they'll have something to oh, talk yeah. about. The cones, they're taking over. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's a cone. So, yeah. It, don't see any text message that comes through. I'll uh I'll play around with the text messaging and I'll So even the road markings, like people in the US they see like if there's a left turn signal, yeah. They see the markings on the road. In Canada we don't see that yet too. I saw as much as even garbage cans. Did oh, you see that wow. tweet? Yeah. Wow. They they even have garbage cans. So like there's a road marking coming up ahead, a left turn and um still still nothing yeah which is too bad but it did take us a few weeks to get smart summon like we didn't True. get smart summon yeah. on release so hopefully our release is maybe before new year hopefully before that, that's op that's optimistic <laughs> <laughs> it's just visuals i know they should make it so when you say jesus take the wheel autopilot would turn on <laughs> Wait, can you send text through um, there? Um, text, uh, how, how are you? <laughs> it popped up the dialer. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, no. Um, oh, hold on. There's messages on here now. Yeah. So before there was dialer, contact, recent favorites, messages. There's no new messages. And Mark sent a couple. Oh, they want you to say open the glove box again. That's what I'm, people are asking. Open glove box. Hopefully no human. Yeah. No human body. There. It's just all speeding tickets. No, <laughs> no big deal. Parking tickets. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is, it's still a pretty cool update. Yeah, no doubt. Drive. Oh, but I should be able to speak to it. Hold on, you're on Android, right? Yes, I'm on Android. Go to. Hold on, can we let's let's try something real quick. Just pull over. Yeah. That we're not like driving and causing Texting, chaos. Yeah. We're gonna get the text thing working, I, I imagine. So if you go to your settings of all your like. Oh, so but I use Signal. Oh. So maybe I don't know. Maybe it's Signal because the Signal blocks because Signal's very secure. Yeah. Wait, you're on Signal? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, we all use Signal as well. I gotta get your number after so we okay. can add you. Um. Yeah, Android secure. So there should be a way if you go to the all app see. settings. Uh, one sec. We're just playing around with the settings right now. Uh, Advanced apps? Apps, yeah. And then find Tesla. You got the new A Better Root Planner app? Yes. It's I, pretty good, I, eh? I, oh my goodness, it's amazing. If you guys uh, haven't tried it, definitely try the Better Root Planner uh, app. So Tesla has to be all the way down. There you go. And then it should say permissions. No, See, I thought it'd be under permissions where it'd have like SMS or something. Maybe Bluetooth? Hold on one sec. Uh, where's your Bluetooth on here? Blue connections. Bluetooth. Uh, that's not what I meant to do. Settings? That's yeah, Bluetooth. message access is, is, is enabled. Oh. Nope. Man, there's still no new messages. I think it's a signal. I think it's yeah, confusing signal. Maybe. Because signal encrypts... All your communications. Yeah. Okay. That, that's okay. Thanks, Mark, for your money. The, the, your carrier will appreciate it. 
Drink some meat when you get back. I don't have time for this. Sun is shining. <laughs> it's sunny here too. Yeah. Mark, I don't think you understand. Look at this. Look at the sun. You left and the sun comes out. One dollar now, man. <laughs> I don't know what kind of baller we're dealing with, eh? But yeah, is there anything else you guys want to see before I end the stream? Like, I think we covered everything, right? Pretty much. I might do... Okay, drinks on Bucci. I'll uh, try text Mark. But you, ha do you have him as a contact? No, right? Yeah, well, he texts me, so yeah. I have his number now. Um, text... Oh, I need to save him, right? Yeah. Yeah. So let's, like, stop. Text Mark? <laughs> no contact found. Sorry, Mark. You're not that important. <laughs> he said save me. Yeah, I'm saving you right away. From all... Um, save Mark. Hold on, we're, we're going to play around with this texting thing. We'll get it to work. So, save, the, save Mark. Save Mark. Yeah, your number <laughs> Hey, good morning. How you doing? All right. So you have my save mark? Yep. All right. Text save mark and say hi. S Steve Mark. Oh, he didn't show up. <laughs> All right, you know what? Let me just uh, modify it to just mark. Text save mark. Okay, so I switch to Mark. Now he's just Mark, let's not show his number. Yeah. <laughs> Text Mark. What? Mark, you're not that important. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, it's it's kind of really neat. And I didn't notice any other setting changes because I was playing around with it earlier. Like, do you notice anything new? No. Nothing on this page. If you notice, they really tried to... This is one of the previous updates, and I didn't really point it out, but see how it says lights at the top? Yep. Locks. Locks. It's cleaner oh, now. Yeah. Right? So lights, I don't see anything. Real quick, I noticed... I realized this yesterday... Uh, I was told about it yesterday. Where was it? Uh, no, it's, it's under display. We'll get to it. So locks. No, nothing new, right? Display. I didn't know you can actually go like. <laughs> oh yeah, you could. <laughs> yeah, I learned that yesterday. Uh, uh, was this here before under locks? Yeah. Um, unlock on park. E yes. Oh okay. Yeah. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, no, it definitely was there. Uh, displays. There's so many settings, it's hard to remember them all. Like, I didn't even know you can ch change your display from... Day to well, night. yeah, yeah. Wow. <laughs> I guess it's not important. No. I... So this is an all-wheel drive dual motor. So if I had uh, purchased the acceleration boost, this standard could have been sport. Does it actually change the sport? Yeah, yeah? it does. Okay. Once you buy the boosts, so... Okay. I don't know if it's worth it though. That's a lot of money. No, oh, no. Put it towards your cyber truck. <laughs> Is there anything new in here? Nope. And then that's just summon. summon, which not here nor there. Speed limits. No, I, I'm not noticing anything different. There's no real setting change. And I don't know if this was um, available before, like your driver profile. If you switch driver profiles, it changes the temperature of the vehicle. So like now, it's it's 20.5. Yep. So if I switch it to, for instance, snowmobile, it switches the temperature. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because so it's part of the profile. Yeah, it's part of the profile. They said the temperature. That's cool. Yeah. So if you have like, I have a snow and a regular. Okay. So my snow one will be like a higher temperature obviously because you yeah, want it to be exactly. warmer yeah. yeah so it'll flip it back and forth the one thing i want them to do is i want passenger profiles oh 
It'd be kind of neat. I mean, it's possible. I just it don't is. know how they integrate it all. Yeah, and how to display it on the screen so that the screen doesn't look clogged as well, right? Mark said he wants to go fund me for the $1 text messages. The boost here is worth it. Rick here bought it and loves it. Save on honk setting. Oh, yeah, where was the save on honk? Oh, no. <laughs> I just like saved your dash uh, cam. Autopilot? Navigation? Safety security? Oh, yeah, yeah. Save on honk. Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah, good call. Save on honk is definitely a new setting. So. Like, you can see the icon change. Honk your horn. Make sure there's no, like, wait till this car goes by. <laughs> that way he doesn't think you're, like, honking at him. Okay. It didn't... Do I have to be on, on drive? I don't know. Oh, it saved, oh, it, it. saved it. Oh, it waited a second, and then it yeah. saved it. Okay, so that's kind of cool. <laughs> Go fund me for Bucci. Yeah, they're saying it's not worth it. They want to go fund me for you so you can get the the, uh, the boost. Two, the boost, yeah. All right. If if you start a GoFundMe, I'll put in. <laughs> I'll start it off. I'll put in twenty dollars for your GoFundMe. Oh, uh, maybe a dollar each for Mark. Everyone a dollar. Everyone a dollar. So we have forty three people watching. You have forty three dollars towards it. Oh wow, that's amazing. But I will give less than a dollar. Mark said. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're deducting the fifty cents. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, he's spent a dollar now. Yeah, because he sent an additional. Because of text fees, he said. So, yeah, it's a it's a pretty cool update. Uh, I mean, for people that have 2.5, at the very least, you have some new games you can play around with. Do you know how to play this one? No idea. All right. And two players can play driver, passenger? Oh, no, no, the best. You can have Tesla versus Tesla. At least you can do it on the... Uh, um, Oh, okay. Yeah, look, see? So if, if you're someone like me who doesn't know how to play, you can have Tesla play against itself. Hmm. You can do this with chess as well. But where is the fun in that? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Make sure you have the right number. Have you been sending some strange in the GTA weird messages? <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's backgammon. And then I wonder if they give you the full blown game so this game is uh like it's an indie game I, just like a guy made it oh okay it's extremely popular online on android when he released it uh like four or five months ago it shot up to it's like in the top 10 highest Whoa. funding games and he charged it's like a 10 dollar game which i know it doesn't seem like a lot but if you think half a million cars at That's a lot. ten dollars each uh i'm surprised this wasn't part of their new like that upgrade thing oh, and the connectivity Either that or, uh, like, you purchase it as, like, oh, a downloadable yeah. content thing. I know Elon has tweeted about um, software developers coming up with games, writing games for Teslas. Yeah. So that will be huge in the future. Yeah, it's going to be massive. So it can actually load games. I tried to load it first. Enable it's tutorial hints. Do you plan on playing this? No. I'll enable it just in case you change your mind. So yeah, you can change your name and everything, and it looks pretty nice already. As you can see, it's like nice big full screen. You can change the style of your farm. So I don't know if you want to set this up. No. No. Okay. My my kids. Can do this. How does your voice thing work? Um, click it. Oh, that I don't know if it'll work in the game. Maybe it's not a game no. thing. Can we try the web browser? Oh look, there's a. Uh, voice thing down here I guess do I have to be in drive google.com sweet but if you're in drive does it work I'm in drive right now if because this this symbol is grayed out before it's no, it's... Down. Yeah, okay. So you can click it or you can click the button. Yeah, so if you click the button, it'll... Google.com. 
and it doesn't go, it verifies to make sure before you can hit enter, and then it'll go. Oh, gotcha. Wow. That's kind of cool. So if you come back, tesla.com. Taco.com. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone want some tacos? <laughs> so yeah, it's kind of cool. Now we're, we're, we're going... <laughs> Technical advisors, custom solutions for all occasions. They're getting some free advertisement right now. All right, switch back to Tesla.com. Sweet. I think you have to open this up before you go into the typing. Tesla.com. See, it listens to you, not to me. But can you do stuff yeah. like Open the web browser to google.com. Open the web browser. Go to google.com. Oh, so he goes? That's pretty cool Without you pressing the enter yeah because i said go to right go to tesla.com that's crazy you don't even have to open up the web browser wow that's so cool uh we we can't do the visualization uh we're in canada we're in canada so this is hardware three it has pylons we showed the pylons earlier in the stream but there's no visualization so but yeah, the the voice thing is really it's, neat. I know, like open Tesla Arcade. Command not understood. Open toy toy box. Open theater. Oh. That's kind of cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Could you like YouTube or Twitch oh, or? Yeah. Um, Play Mother Franca on YouTube. <laughs> Playing Mother Franca on YouTube. Whoa! Oh no, it popped up the. <laughs> um, Mother Franca channel on YouTube app. Try just open YouTube. Open YouTube app. Command not understood. It can't open YouTube. Which is too bad. Open Netflix. So it can open Netflix, yeah. but it can't open YouTube. That's kind of interesting. Yeah. Open Twitch. Command not found. So it only gives love to Netflix, mm. nothing else. That's weird. Is there anything else you want to show or we can... Um. <laughs> we can end it. I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, we, we covered it all. Uh, if you guys have any last minute additional questions, I'll leave it going for like the next minute and a half. And if not, we're going to end the stream. You know the one I wish they fixed? We are talking about it yesterday. Is this. Because you should show the reindeers and everything. Oh, I didn't, I, I didn't have the vehicle last year, so. Can you say open Stardew Valley? Valley. Oh, okay, hold on one second. <laughs> open Stardew Valley. Command not understood. I guess it still needs to learn this new games and stuff like that. Oh, Open nice. 2048. Open 2048. Yeah, it, it doesn't know the games yet. I think they're going to add it, but like, it's already a huge step up from what we had before. Like, I'm really impressed. Yeah. Uh, just the voice commands alone might be the most useful uh, feature we got this past year for everyday driving. Yeah, I just we just need to figure out the whole text uh, text and yeah, all thing. I'm gonna play around with it today, and then I'll put out a video explaining uh, the best way to get it to working. I don't know if it's a signal thing.
yeah so anyways hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh thanks for watching you want to say anything before we end it um thanks well, bucci so much for showing me his hardware three car on christmas eve christmas eve i know <laughs> not only that like i was up i got my car update at 5 a.m this morning but no it was like 4 40 or something i woke up at 4 40 started updating yeah. my car and i was like who's up i need someone up i want to go shoot a video actually i was so surprised like i got the update i'm like what i'm not in early access or whatever and i'm like oh update i'm like sure why not so, so anyway guys thanks for watching check out bucci i'll have a link in his in the description below uh after i get to edit the description so you guys can check that out thanks for watching guys i'll see you guys next time make sure to subscribe for more tesla content see you guys later